Today's video is brought to you by Get Your Guide. Good morning from Palawan. Today is excursion day. Woohoo! Woo so there are some major activities that you and your family are going to want to take advantage of here in Palawan. But today we have a full docket. What's going on? Yeah, today we have four major things. We are going to go experience the underground river, um, which is like super famous here. And then we are going to have lunch on the beach. Woohoo! And have like local cuisine, which is great. After that, we get to do a zip line along the coastline. Nice. Yes. And then after that, we're going to do a like a paddle boat through the mangrove. Okay, well it all gets started now. The kids are already in the van. They pick you up at the hotel. We are staying at the Princessa Garden. Princessa. I always have a hard, hard time with that one. Princessa Garden. <laughs> okay guys, ready to go? Yep, yep. All right, all right, cool. So I think we are picking up a few more people. Um, you guys, you're sitting there? Well, okay, be. where do I sit? Up front. front. Okay. All right, so I am in the front. Oops, sorry. Okay, you guys ready to go? Yep. Okay. Off to the excursions. So we're about the halfway point, I yes. would say, and it's a view deck, so we'll go check that out. But the drive has been beautiful. Oh, everything's green, like it's monsoon time, so everything's just lush. Yeah, quite dirty. vibrant. Yeah. The roads are awesome. The roads Nothing, are, no yeah. concern yeah. there. And uh, yeah, quite nice. And you can see this is like definitely like the stop that everybody stops at. So you've got some tourist touristy things up here. Oh, take a peek at the view. Oh, there are bathrooms, guys. Who needs to go to the bathroom? Yeah, bathrooms are just over here. So we'll take a peek here at the view, but you can see, like, you know, knickknacks and stuff for sale. Uh, it looks like the view's up here, but you can't quite go all the way out there. But yeah, you can see, man, the water is gorgeous, the mountains. I'm pretty excited to uh, really experience everything that today's gonna offer with the. Uh, views the underground river gonna be nice so we'll hit the bathrooms i don't think we're gonna really stop or buy anything um besides lunches included in the tour anyway so we'll get that uh get that sorted here in just a minute we are now officially at the port and this area is where we're done with the van until we're heading back uh, to like kind of the next destinations but to get to the underground river we actually have to take a boat there so you can see we're in this like pretty touristy area there's lots of vendors selling stuff tons of people and this is sort of like the waiting area the dispatching area and we'll wait here until our guide organizes everything gets the boats um and we just kind of yeah, hang out and wait he said uh it's just like patience cooperation but you can kind of see these are all types of the boats that are going to be taking people out these like kind of cool looking boats but this is all the waiting area you guys doing okay yeah we're doing good good car ride yeah yeah easy no problem. But yeah, this is all all the waiting area. How long will the wait be? It's hard to say. I think as soon as our guy can get a boat, we go. And I don't know if like, we would wait for all these people to go first or not. But either way, it seems pretty organized in the sense of that the guide is doing all, all, the, all the work for us. But yeah, it's very pretty. The waves are looking pretty good. They have it all blocked off probably. I imagine that waves could in theory come up and over. That's why this rope's here. But yeah, big waves coming in. All of these boats, all these boats are the ones that will take us to the underground cave. But man, it's beautiful. They're building some kind of stage here. But yeah, all these people are uh, going to the underground cave river as well. So yeah, it's very cool. Very cool. We'll just hang out. I think we have, probably have time for like a little coconut or something. Let's see, uh, let's see about that. All right, how's it going, fam? Good. Should we get a coconut? I think a so. A coconut? I'm pretty thirsty. That is a... Okay, let's see that. I think it's... Well, we're going to hold off on ice cream. Let's get a coconut first. Oh, Mr. Coffee. All right, you guys ready? Oh, no, thanks. Necklaces, bathrooms. Right here are the bathrooms. But just all types of vendors. I mean, as one would expect. So we'll go and get... Uh, go and grab a coconut, I think. Uh, I know a single use plastics. That's good. I wonder if I'll do paper straws with the coconut. Guys, coconuts, how many should we get? We have also two? Probably two. Two. We'll take two. What's there out there? No, we'll take two coconuts. Two? Yes, ma'am. Jane, do you want to run your socks? Alright. Oh, you're gonna ditch your socks? Good call. Is that ours? I've got I've got a uh, no, I've got my granite, I've got the uh, bag here, but we can also give it to the guide. Alright, so two coconuts, plenty to split. You guys ready for this? 
Sounds like it's going to be a pretty good adventure. Yeah. Riding the boat into the cave. Two coconuts. Thank you. Oh, big coconut. You want to go first? Oh. Okay. Wow, there's a lot of water. In All right, yeah, that's a juicy one. It's a big one, at least. Woo. Yum. Yummy. Full. Yummy. Yay. Woo -hoo. <laughs> the boy likes it. Yeah. You guys want to sit on the bench and drink or? Okay. Okay, thank you so much. Granite, you want to get on some of this one? Mm -hmm. caught. Woo, it's leaking. For her. <laughs> hey, here, puppy. For trying to get the drips. So there was a time not that long ago where Forrest was not a huge fan of these coconuts. I'm glad his uh, palate is evolving. Yeah, this one's a little sour. No. <laughs> Yum. All right. He's just letting it drip on his face. Forrest, you can use the straw, buddy. Here you go, Cal. You go. You guys are going to split that one? Yeah, we'll split that All one. right, so yeah, divide and conquer, as they say. All right, so afterward, they just split them, they scrape them, and we'll enjoy the meat as well. Let me eat. Yeah. It's a coconut meat. My bite? No, meat, meat. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yummy. <laughs> Slippery. Slippery. <laughs> And good? Mm, nice. Here, it. Yeah, you know, listen, when it comes to a day like today where it's kind of humid out, a coconut goes a long way. Yeah, refreshing. Good. You like it, Cedar? Nice. All right, so we'll pause. She's off. We'll rejoin kind of the waiting area we're supposed to wait and just kind of hang out until we're called for a boat. I have a hunch it's going to be sort of a hurry up and wait situation, but we'll get it, we'll get it done. All right, you guys ready for this? Yeah. Okay, yeah, so yeah, basically yeah. the plan, we're gonna walk right down there. There's been some big waves coming over onto the boat. You ready for this for us? Yeah. Okay, I think we can do it, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, come on. So yeah, see, you take his hand. There, thanks, I go. Okay, here we go. Granite, careful. There's a big wave. Go, Granite. Kelly, you go next. Okay. Okay, all right, here we go. Woo! Oh, right, hey, my baby. All right. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All right. Okay, so now we're going to get life jackets on. I know, bossing. Oh, yeah, there is. Yes, There's yes. There's a smaller one. Go. Nice. Woo! I'm in buckle. I got you, buddy. Don't worry. Okay, and then this one. All right, they're getting buckled in. Cedar, are you in? No. Nope. You're still working on it? Okay. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. Get myself buckled in here in just a second, and Jonathan's getting long buckled. All right. Woo! All right. So we were wondering if they were going to have a small size for Forrest, and they did. So the, a little on the, like these are adult size on granite and cedar, but you know that's just the way of it. But the fact that they had this little one for Forrest, phew! Thank goodness. All right. So Echo, how long is the boat ride? Oh, it takes about less than half an hour. Okay, all right, cool. So less than 30 minutes and we'll be there. Wow, gorgeous. And how many people are going into the cave today, do you think? Well, I think it's like less than 1,000. Okay, yeah. okay, just under 1,000 people will do this. So tourism is really back. That's right, yeah. Okay, good, Woo! good, good, good. What was it like during the uh, the pandemic years? But so bad. So yeah, bad. Yeah, most, well, actually most of the people here, especially the boatmans, what they did, during the pandemic, they're in uh, constructions. Okay. Uh, some of them, they're doing fishing. Okay, so most people were able to sort of offset 
the tourism by that's right. jumping. Yeah. That's good. Yep. That's good. Uh huh. Yeah. But good. Yeah, glad to see. Uh, yeah, tourism's definitely back that's in right. Taiwan. Woohoo! So I didn't mention this morning, but all of this was organized through GetYourGuide.com. Uh, so we're pretty thankful to uh, have gotten with that organization. More on them kind of in another part of the video. But yeah, Get Your Guide was able to sort of put all this together for us. So thanks so much to those guys. Hey everybody, I hope you're enjoying today's video. I want to thank today's sponsor, Get Your Guide. As a traveling family who also works full time and takes care of three young kids, we often reach out to others to help us plan our trips. Get Your Guide has over 60,000 curated experiences in over 3,600 destinations. So you could travel the Philippines like we have with them, or you can go to another destination worldwide. Some of the things that we really liked about Get Your Guide is that they pair you with a local expert. So you're gonna get the best one-of-a-kind local tours. They're gonna tell you about the food and the culture and the history of the area. So they're gonna be able to give you a lot of insight that you might not find just by walking around on your own. We also really like that they have 24 seven support. When we were trying to coordinate our trip across time zones, it was really helpful to be able to call somebody and say, hey, how do we get a ride? How do we connect with our guide and that kind of stuff. So there's also a free cancellation up to 24 hours. So if something should come up or the weather's bad or you have an emergency, you are able to cancel a day before. A great value that we didn't get to use on this trip, you can have a skip the line value. That's a benefit if you have kids. They don't have to wait in line before you actually go into a museum or on one of their tours. And the final thing that we really like about Get Your Guide is that from the app, you can just download your tickets and you don't have to find a printer while you're traveling. Thank you, sir. Hey, right, Boris. Come here, I gotta pick you up. Oh, I got these low ceilings. Just be careful with this flicker. Okay. All right. all right, whoo, sorry for the shakiness, but we're all getting out here. You want to go to Okay, hold on, buddy. You got to get it. Watch your flip flops. Okay. 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 Woo! Got it. All right, thank you. We'll see you in a little bit. What? What? Here, here, here. Okay, buddy. Woo! Boris says he wants to get wet. Whoa, well, in the ocean! Okay, guys, how was the butt ride? Good. That was cool. That was great. It was nice. Refreshing, good breeze. And, yeah, uh, not too not too hot or humid. Okay, so the other part of our group is right over here. So let's connect with those guys. Come okay. here, Forrest. You want Daddy to carry you? <laughs> Forrest, you want Daddy to carry you? <laughs> Are you having fun? Yes. Ah. Oh, you guys see, man? Look at that, guys. Got to push that boat back out against the waves. There's two of them. But my goodness. Gorgeous. Kelly's going to set up some photos for Instagram. You're more than welcome to join us on that page as well. Kelly works super hard to build that up. And we're almost at 10,000. Almost. Almost. Yeah, we're getting yes. there. Getting there, slowly but surely. All right, but you can see lots of groups, very organized, and all these boats. Forrest, you're going to walk, bud. Yeah. Okay. Your feet are going to get a little sandy, but that's okay, all right? Okay, so we'll uh, look for the other parts of our group. We wear the vests. There's our group. And I think they're gonna, I think we got a five minute hike to get to the other boat, which takes us into the cave. Okay. So five minute hike into the cave. Yeah, we're good. All right, see you there, Forrest. This is our group here. Wow, this is gorgeous, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Kind of want to just hang on the beach. Yeah, for a no while. kidding. Go beach swimming day. out there. Yeah. I mean, these rocks. Guys, follow me. Alright, follow you. Alright. Echo is an awesome guy. He's a marine biologist by trade, so he does this. He's in school. He's just telling he us, I mean he's he's, he's like yeah. so smart. Yeah. And he's telling us all the facts and information. It's really really About good. Animals and geology and, yeah, and they have sea turtles here he was telling us, so yep. that's even cooler. Yeah. Alright, now I might have to carry Forrest. Once so, he starts getting sand in his shoe. Forrest, you want me to carry you, dude? Want me to carry you? Yeah. Okay, babe. Oh. All right, five minutes. Gonna get some muscles. Here we go. Protection. Okay, so now just off the beach, actually. Uh, helmets. This is protection for the cave. So it looks like they're adjustable in the back. That is adjustable if you want to tighten or yeah. rotate at the back of your head. 
Thank you. Yeah, twist, twist, twist. And Cedar, you got that? Good girl. Okay. Sir? Thank you, sir. And right. Forrest. Oh, yeah. Here's yours. Okay. There you go. All right, big boy. Let me see if we can get this to work for you. Okay, the entrance of the cave is on the other side. So the only restroom here in this area is see. here. So we're going hey. to All right, Forrest, you look like a construction dude. You yeah. ready to go? Yeah. Into the cave? Yeah. All right, so again, about a five minute walk. You got our kind of our whole group here. And we're good to go. All right, so uh, Echo's going to stay back, but we have this audio guide in our ear now. So it's actually playing. So I'm learning that this is uh, one of the world wonder. Actually, I can't talk about that on. But basically, it's a world wonder site, one of the top seven natural world wonders. And a uh, UNESCO site, it's 8.2 kilometers, the world's longest underground river. Uh, is what we're going into. We're going in like a one and a half kilometers. Uh, beyond that point, you would need special permits to get back there. It gets much more narrow. So we'll be actually in the cave for about 45 minutes. But uh, yeah, this is cool. It's fun. Yeah. I like this. Yeah. It's very calm, quiet, seated. There's, uh, there's music, uh, kind of like yeah. new age. <laughs> oh, and it says I'm supposed to stay silent. So I will basically film in there as far as I can, um, but of course we have like, you know, other people on the boat, so I don't want to be all disrupting their experience, but you can see it's unbelievably beautiful. You know, somebody told me that these caves are uh, what Avatar is based on, all these like floating mountains. I don't know if that's true or not, but okay. You can already feel the cold air coming at you. It's so nice. The rower back here doing all the work. He has a headlamp, so he'll be able to illuminate in here for us. Oh, here comes the rain. Oh, Forrest, did you get rain done? Ooh. So all the water dripping down. And this is actually we're going against the current. So the in inward water flow, you would have to hike like three hours to get to that point. Um, to start on that side. So this is actually where the water exits. But, whoa. And we'll be in the cave for about 45 minutes. <laughs> Boy, is this cool? Yeah. Okay, we're getting to the point where, uh, oh, there's that lamp. But you get the idea. Beautiful. And there's another boat coming at us. So at this point, I'm going to probably put the camera away until we're more illuminated. But so cool. And I gotta, I want to get back to my story. It's new age music. It's just the GoPro won't do this justice, but we're in the cathedral. Huge. Wow. <clears throat> that one just like a horse with the wings. This is the head. Oh, the Pegasus. Wings. It's like, like a horse with wings. Horse Let's say this looks like corn. <sighs> Mushroom. Wow. The light oh. That was awesome. So these guides do seven to ten trips every day. I can't imagine the amount of like muscle mass I'd have to take for this guy to paddle all of us. Wow. So we're gonna land back over here and I'll get everybody's opinion. All right guys, how was that? Oh, uh, that was cool. Amazing. I actually like the guided earpiece more than I thought I was gonna like it. <laughs> yeah, it, actually uh, the uh, earpiece is funny because it was like cracking jokes and stuff about bat caves they play batman music it was uh yeah, entertaining yeah it was entertaining and definitely scientific and our guide was really funny too yeah the guy who's steering the boat so yeah that was uh quite epic uh you certainly if you're in the area that's absolutely 100 percent worth doing yeah because it was just so cool to see of course i couldn't capture any of that on the gopro because it's just too dark but with the guide's lights yeah you're able to see all types of uh 
cool formations and learn the history. I mean, there's so much and it's cool a, stuff in there. Kind of a neat way. It's a neat way to um, explore the Philippines and you get a, like a, a break from the heat and humidity. Yeah. Cause you're nice, nice, cool, dark cave and it's just something different. Forrest, did you like it? Yeah, I'm hungry. Oh, you're hungry. All right. Oh, yeah. Well, we're coming up to lunch. Lunch is also included yep. in our tour. So it's some kind of like a buffet, I believe. I don't know if that's on site here or we're going to take the boat back across, but we'll find out. Granite, yeah. how was that for you? Really cool. Yeah, would you recommend it? Yeah. That was awesome. Oh, the you, what was your favorite part? The sculpturing. The sculptures? Mm -hmm. Did you like that part about the Mario Brothers Daddy. joke? Yeah. That yeah, was cool. <laughs> yeah, Forrest. I like the bats. You like all those bats? Yeah. They are they were sleeping. Upside down? Yeah. They were sleeping upside down? Yeah. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah, thousands sure. upon thousands of bats. I, I tried to catch her in on your phone, but I'm not sure. All right, so we'll, we'll see. see. If I can, it'll be on Instagram. If not, have to use your imagination. Cedar, yeah. what was your favorite part of that? Um, I got maybe the Jesus. Oh, the Jesus face? Yeah. There was all types of like... Um, Rock formations that they had named. Yeah, like so for example, there was yeah. like the Last Supper sculptures. There was the Jesus face. Um, carrots mushrooms the whole nine yards all formations that were in there so you can't go further back than just that 1.2 or 1.4 k you would just need a special permit but it sounded like you would just apply for it like it might not be all that hard to do but either way we loved it you can hear the thunder rolling um yeah that was a absolutely an amazing experience to do very cool so now we'll kind of continue on and see what's uh, going to go on for the lunch Buddy, I got you. Come here. Oh. Mm. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, it's just a little sketchy this part. Okay. Got you. Working out for us? Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, go There you go. Gotcha. Okay, you got these little bars. Okay. All right. All right. Phew. I made it. <laughs> I was like, please don't fall. Please don't fall. Please don't fall. <laughs> made it. <laughs> Glad you didn't. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Five back kid. Five back kid. Yeah. So guys, that was uh, ultimately a great adventure. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely outstanding. Got a bit of a boat traffic jam here. Always an adventure. Pouring down the rain. Get it for us. That's okay, Come buddy. Go we're gonna go home real soon. Get some food. But we're kind of in this queue to unload the boat, but it's super choppy, and I think we're just sort of waiting. waiting for a minute. But yeah, so that's part of the experience. Just down the road, really, from the pier where we got off from all the rain is the lunch spot. Now it's a buffet style lunch as i understand it and there are a ton of groups here so i basically think what happens is you sign up for this group you sign up for the group yeah yeah sign up for the group and then you like come to this communal buffet hey guys yeah so this is going to be a big lunch buffet oh there's all types of good food though bananas fruit filipino food nice Okay, all right, is, this is our table. Forrest, you want to be in the head of the table? No, my feet are dirty. No, your feet are dirty, that's okay. Here you go, bud. Oh, we need to wash them. Here, I'll take your shoes off. Here we go, just put it here. All right, so the buffet is pretty extensive. I mean, rice, noodles, beef, fish, it looks like. A bunch of cut vegetables sort of in the middle but you can see it's just like a long line but you can see fresh vegetables cucumbers papaya salads fried bananas chicken beef yeah it's uh goes both both directions so essentially i got the kids already oh and they have soup all the vinegars nice so yeah quite the scene kelly are you doing good yeah doing good nice got a bunch of noodles nice right, yeah start with that there's a papaya salad in the middle that's pretty good. All right, so the kids are already 
plate it up just to give you an idea of what it looks like. Yeah, Forrest. I want egg and rice. Egg and rice. You want rice? Yeah, egg and rice. Egg? And I don't know if they have egg, but I'll get you some rice. Okay. Okay. All right. So, guys, how's the food? Good. 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 Beef, chicken. You got spring rolls, rice, chicken. Yum. All right. So uh, that's it. I'll show you Kelly. She has a veg. What she's gonna get? <laughs> How'd you? Oh, nice. Check out these vegetables. Yeah. Good yes. veg plate. Look at the bananas, gummy. Bananas. Cucumbers, sauteed vegetables, spinach or greens. Nice. There's there also a super bit of veg with like a bunch of vinegar and stuff. I see people. In the oh, middle. I see the middle section. Yeah. Is pretty awesome. Cool. All right, my turn. Brandon, how's the coconut, man? Nice. So just to give you an idea of the food I got, uh, a whole fish. They had fish count. I got a whole fish. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Yummy. So fish, beef, or maybe that could be possibly be pork. Papaya salad, veg. Forrest, you want some fish? Forrest typically. Uh, really enjoys fish. Here you go, babe. Yeah, lucky kid, man. Cedar, you want some of the fish? Ooh, it's hot. Ah, man. Wow, that's hot. That just came out of the oven. All right, I'll, I'll skip the fish for now, but the beef. Yum. Good food. Noodles. Go for that papaya. I'm excited to do the zip line. Yeah, hopefully the rain passes. Should be a good time. Mmm. The pie is out spicy. Woo. Is it? Is yeah, it's nice. Kick? Mm. A little kick. See, so you can run up and grab yourself a fish. They're right in the middle. Where all that where, where these were. Right, I'm gonna try. You want you want to taste it first? Um a little piece of fish? Cool. Alright. A little bit of bone. Mm. Nice. Of course, that's a fish. Delicious? Nice. You want more? Just that piece? Okay. Yeah, Forrest, fan of the econ. All right, so the next phase of this tour really is the mangroves paddleboard tour. Yeah. And uh, we'll kind of find out what that's all about. So we had the cave, the no, lunch. Paddle boat, I think. Paddle boat. Yeah, with a cover over it. Oh, cool, even better. All right, let's head that way and paddleboard, find out. Paddleboard, though, would be pretty awesome. Yeah, I, man, the whole time I thought I was paddleboarding. <laughs> I think it's. Pedal boat, but it's not like well, the, the pedal, size is pedal boat, so that but makes not sense. pedal boat, not like yeah, yeah. I don't know well, I don't is. know what to expect now. Like nah. So, a okay, all right, cool, cool. So, yeah, anyway, so it's been uh, quite the day. I mean, with these three different parts so far, and we still have a zip lining to go. Yeah, so this is a great tour, I think. Yeah, good, just get out and explore. Yeah, so each event is well organized. Us, so. Yeah, I mean, everyone's like pretty cool, filling up the paperwork there, but the property is uh. Property is beautiful. All right, so we'll uh, kind of figure out what the paddle boating is all about. Yeah. So you're right, isn't that a paddle boat? A boat with a paddle. Yeah, but we're not doing it. Like paddling. a canoe, but a big. Girl. So through the mangroves. Yeah, it's yeah, gonna that'd be, be cool. Yeah. Super chill she and said, peaceful, I think. Yeah, or he said we might be able to see uh, mangrove snakes. And yeah, it's kind of wildlife crab. stuff. So. Yeah. He said crabs are out here and. Meranpa. I think lots of birds too on cool. top of. Little fish. I don't know if we'll see it in the water, yeah, but so this is definitely like a chill, relaxing part of that. Just, yeah, of we journey. just ate a huge meal, so we probably just nap too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just yeah. Well, it looks really gorgeous. I mean, uh, the mangroves certainly like this is what it is right here. ecosystem galore here. Right? Yep, absolutely. It's just beautiful here in the Philippines, and it's very uh, different than the um, Abu Dhabi mangroves that we went to see way back oh, in the day. Yeah. Those early videos, yep. Yeah. I'll link that right here if you want to see us <laughs> really uh, looking silly. <laughs> yeah. Mangroves do so much for the ecosystem, just like that nursery ground for all types of marine um, animals. Yeah. Which is great. Lovely. And birds. Yeah. Gorgeous. Oh, that's nice. All right, well. So that mountain, that is the mountain of underground. Good afternoon, everyone. Just get Good started. Afternoon. So we're just at the turnaround point of these mangroves, but man, gorgeous. It's so peaceful. Yeah, it's nice. It's, um, we just saw a lizard. We've seen a couple snakes and, um, just learning about the mangroves from our guide. It's yeah. uh, pretty cool. The different types and the rules and the protections in place. Um, yeah. Yeah. Conservation's great. Conservation's here. great. Yeah. Um, this area has been protected since 1981, yeah. which is really cool. And, um, yeah. 
She was just saying how it changes with the tides because you get the high tide and the water's in and we're like at, a, a bluer color and then low tide it all goes out and takes the sediment with it. So we're at low tide now and the high tide, you can see that black line. That's where the water will rise to. So right now we're at the low tide. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. Mosquitoes are definitely out. The mosquitoes <laughs> are out now. There's a lady selling like, insect repellent and we're like, no, we don't need it. And I'm like, well, wish we would have. Wish yeah. we would have got it. It's kind of the same when um, the lady was selling the dry bags just before the storm <laughs> cracked open on the ocean. <laughs> and we're like, we don't need a dry bag. So, right. <laughs> it's pouring rain. Well, you can see, I mean, it just goes way back in there. Shh. <laughs> so that was great. Did you yeah. did you learn a lot on that? Yeah. I thought I did. I mean, the, what was your favorite part to see? The snakes. Yeah, the snakes are cool. I think we saw three snakes, three snakes. two different lizards, yeah, and a bunch of birds. Uh, and listen to those. Yeah, the cicadas. How, how was it so loud. So loud. And so that was happy. that was awesome. That was about, about 40 minutes. I mean, 20 minutes in, 20 minutes out. All right. So one of the added delicacies bonus on this mangroves tour is the wood worm. So if we're really lucky, this guy's gonna chop this open, and they're oh my god, it's so big. Look, it's right there. Janet, you want to get in on this? Yeah, all right. Are they alive? Yeah, they're alive. They're in there. Oh my goodness. That one's huge. Oh my god. The size of that thing is humongous. Oh my god. It's like the size of a snake. <laughs> it's a head. Wow. <laughs> That's ridiculous. What's coming out of it? Mud, I guess. It's the fiber. Fiber. So I'm gonna watch this. I'm okay, you wash it out? Okay, I'll follow you. Okay. Okay, so the way you eat them, you wash them? Yes. And then you put them in vinegar, you said? Yes, yes, yes. Wow. I'm gonna put uh, coconut vinegar. Okay, a little vinegar. Yeah. So we have coconut vinegar. Okay, okay. So how to wash this? Oh, I don't have this. Oh, this one. Oh, okay. So I'm gonna cut this. Okay. That way. I need a Oh, wow. Look at that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. There. Just water. Okay, so you clean out basically like is that the like the guts? This is one. It's what? Yeah, fresh water. Okay, fresh water. And cleaning. I'm, yes, cleaning the tamilo. Wow, you can see all that residue. Here. Yeah. Okay. Then I'm gonna cut into small pieces. Okay, yeah, better. Are you what, sir? You're gonna it long or just small pieces? Well, my son wants some too, so maybe like two or three pieces. Okay, sure. <laughs> yeah, Granite uh, thinks he's gonna go for it too, so I hope so. Cedar said maybe. Well, actually, I'll make it four pieces. Okay, four pieces. <laughs> and then after this, coconut vinegar. Okay, coconut vinegar. Okay, so that's <laughs> coconut vinegar? Yes, coconut Should vinegar. Should we pour the water out or is that okay? And is that is the coconut vinegar for flavor or does that help for like sterilize? This is exactly from coconut. Okay. Then I will get some salt. Okay, a little salt as well. Oh, so in goes the salt. And okay. Salt. Well, it's less intimidating when it's cut up like that. It's not like uh, some big, huge, long thing. <laughs> okay, here. Okay, is it ready to eat or yeah, do we? Okay. Ready to eat that one. Okay. So there it is, the cut up woodworm. Oh my gosh, so should, there are four pieces here if you want to get one. I'll take one. All right, you want to hold the bowl, Cal, for us? Too bad then. Doesn't look now that it's clean. No, it's all cleaned out. So it, uh, vinegar, it's got coconut vinegar and salt. 
coconut vinegar and salt. So it looks like it won't be too bad. No. I'm not, when it came out of that log, it was wow. huge. Oh man, it's got some, here you want to trade pieces? Sure. Yeah, it was a little bit smaller. Yeah, I'll take the biggie. Okay, you guys. All right. Oh what do you think, Granite? Pretty good. Millions of views. Okay, we'll see. Ready? One, two, three. Wow. Guys, look, look at this. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yeah, that's really good. Wow, bravo. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Swallow. You got it? Mm -hmm. So, I, I, they say oysterish. I, I can see that. It's kind of like an oyster. You going for seconds? Yeah. Yeah? All right. Uh, Oh, there's only one little bit. You want that one? Sure. Wait. Well, hold on, hold on. Hi, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Time for a photo. I'll do do everything slow. Go for it. Nice. It's good. It doesn't taste like uh, weird or anything. It just tastes like a... A slimy little worm. Slimy slime. Nice job. Cool, so woodworm. They say uh, nature's Viagra, so we'll find out. Oh man, they're all over. There's tons of them. Yeah, go back in there. Look at it. Wow. There's just so many coming out of that one piece of... Oh, they're everywhere. <laughs> mm -hmm, like that. Oh, that's so big. <laughs> oh. They're just coming right out of there. Yeah? No big deal. So, be my new favorite food. That was really good. That was tasty. I mean, the vinegar helps a lot. Wow, and that and that and all that came out of that one piece of wood. Yes. Yeah, so so I can't imagine like... Uh, how many are actually in there, or how many are in all these woods? Yeah. Oh, cool. so pretty good. All right, well, that's just sort of an added bonus of the uh, of the mangrove uh, tour. Is you could potentially get yourself some woodworms. All right, so up next is the sort of the final uh, excursion on this trip, and that's the zip lining. So we're at this beautiful property. I can see all the zip lining gear over there. Oh, there's that orientation that we're gonna go to. Hello, how are you? Okay, so orientation time. We got a, some kind of video for us to watch. Uh, that's cool. Get the idea. Oh, you can do the Superman pose, it looks like. Wow, that'll be fun. You guys ready for this adventure? Woohoo! All right, guys. Cedar, you're looking like you're ready to go. Helmet it up. So we're all choosing to do the Superman pose. That's like this one. Oh, thank you, my gloves. Now, Forrest is going to stay with Echo, so that's really nice that he's going to do that. That way, Kelly can uh, enjoy Join as well. In. Yeah. Sometimes you get the short end of the stick that way, but, uh, <laughs> oh, no, you know. Oh, no, it's good. Oh, You're going to come I on know. that little hike with us, bud. You can come for part of it. No. So part of the adventure to get to the top where you zip line down is uh, getting to the top, and that's going to be a hike. Guys, we get to actually go through caves. Yeah, that's gonna be cool. So they said you can wear any shoes you want, and we're all just wearing our sliders um, because the caves dry on the inside, so it's no problem. But there's actually a bit of like uh, ropes and harnesses inside the cave, so that's cool. That's the exit. Ooh, get okay, you pumped up? Yeah. Superman. Mm -hmm. Nice. <laughs> Muddy. No, slip no slipping. I can't slip. Yes, uh, too too close to home with the uh, Kelly and the slipping. You, can, slipping you can't see. Too. It's pretty oh. muddy. Okay, so Forrest is staying with Echo. He had some tears there, but we bribed him with a pair of gloves, a helmet, and then when we get back to our hotel, he's going to get to feed the fish. So that all worked out okay. Ooh. Okay. Leave nothing but footprints, bring nothing back memories. Oh. All right, I, I like all that. We go okay, a little okay. group photo, cave entrance. Whoa, like that. it's so dark. I like it. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's pretty. Sorry. Bats? Bats? Yeah. No. <laughs> wow. 
Yeah. I got my glove on. Right. Oh, it does. Oh, that is nice. Yeah. Yeah, very cool. So you can I'm see. Up we go and in. All right. So out of cave number one, it's a cool, cool hike for sure. The guides take time to explain a lot of the formations in there, and then you're back onto this like paved trail again. So, yeah, a combination of kind of a rough hike and then smooth trail. Nice, kind of an interactive hike. Okay, getting through. Oh wow! Yeah, up the stairs we go. Okay, up she goes. Up All right, Kel, how's that? Good. <laughs> cool. So I got harnessed up, a little rock scramble at the end, and now yeah. up this like super big, steep ladder. Big ladder. They got the they got the rope down on it, so it's not so not so slippery. Yep. Yeah, that's helpful. Ah. Whoo! Yeah, high pitch here. Okay, kids are up ahead. A little bit of a rock scramble for them. So let's see if I can do this here. Oh, okay. All right. So I can do this without getting stuck. Oh, I gotta get the leg over. Okay, not bad. Got it. Oh wow. Oh, that's so cool. Way up there. Tight squeeze. Oh yeah, Here we go. made it to the top. Yay! Superman, let's take a look at the view. I think that's where we're gonna launch from, though. That's good, Kelly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Woohoo! Yeah. I'm trying to gain my confidence after uh, after yeah. my jungle trek. Yeah, where she fell and broke her wrist in Sumatra. Congratulations, sir. Yeah, we did it. Thank you. Wow. I survived. Zipline, how do we use our shoes? Because I'll probably just hold them or something. I don't know. Okay. Maybe there'll be a bag. Let's do a photos. Yeah, photos. Good idea. And then, but we just oh, you go to beautiful the whole village. That's cool, Granite, huh? Yeah, sounds like some kind of band practice is going on down at the school. Hear the drums? Yeah, yeah. Well, that's awesome. Elementary, high school. elementary and high school there. Okay, that the greens the elementary. Yeah. And, this um, is the high school. Yeah. Do they learn English or what are they learning there at those schools? Just the basic education, math. reading, writing, math. History. Yeah. Gorgeous. Did you go to this school or no? Sorry. Did you go to school here or no? Yeah. I get you it. went to school there. Nice. Nice. That's great. Beautiful. Okay. Well, we'll enjoy the view. Oh, there's Cedar. Where are you? <laughs> so they get the photos posted fast. These are, I assume, for sale. Oh, there's the other. So cute. Yeah. <laughs> and the last one. Oh, good time. Cedar. Get it. Hey. Superman. Getting all strapped in for the Superman photos. Okay, so one step back now. Step back down. Lay down, lay down slowly. Okay. Whoa. Are you ready? I'm ready. First leg, sir. First leg. Ready? Yeah. Ready, Go. All right. Woo! Gorgeous. Wow. Woo! Ah, so nice. Oh wow, that is awesome. Right onto the roof. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Stand up. Okay, got it. Step down. Step down, okay. Perfect. Wow, that was awesome. <laughs> I think that's Granite coming in. You got us, Granite! Woo! 
How was that? That was scary. Yeah, that was Superman pose. Nice job, buddy. All right, see you there. Pull the rope, mom. Grab the rope. Pull the rope. Grab the rope, see there. Grab it. Good girl. Hold on, hold on. Hold on to your head. Yeah. Woo! It's good, Grant? Oh, yeah. Guys. Step down. down. How was it, Cedar? Good. Good girl. Oh, man. So much fun, huh? Yes. Would you do that again? Yes. Superman pose? Yes. Yeah. That was awesome. So, who's left? Mom. Now, you think Mom's going to scream the whole way? Yeah. I definitely did. Yeah. I'm pretty sure Mom's going to freak out. Yeah. My face is blowing. Oh yeah, that was awesome. Okay, here comes mom. Yep. mommy. Good job, mom. Woohoo! Super lady, super woman. Grab it. Grab the rope. Grab the rope. Callie, grab the rope. Oh, mom, mom. Oh. Bye. <laughs> well, I'm gonna butter strike too. Woohoo! That was funny. <laughs> Just miss it by that much. Her arms. Did you think you're going back up? I got two drives. Nice. Oh, no. okay. Did you hear me scream at the start when yeah. I was going down? Yeah. Uh, Mom, you missed okay. the rope. Man, what an adventure, guys. Think Whoa. about that. That was crazy. Zip lining, caving. Oh, yeah. Rivering, rock climbing. <laughs> rock climbing, holy cow. This place is awesome. Boating, yes. Outdoor adventurous. Outdoor adventurous. I yeah. like it. And what, did Forrest sleep through that entire right, he was, I thought he was going to go down there and watch us. He's I didn't sleeping. See. Oh, he's sleeping? Yeah. Oh my okay. goodness. Well, we'll go spy on Forrest here in a minute. Yeah. Sleeping on the bench below us. I did. I was like, I was looking for him. I didn't see him. I would see them. Echoes down there waving, fanning him. Nice. <laughs> so, Granite, this is uh, okay. on the on the bucket list to do. Yeah, thank you. Nice. And uh, just think, man, they only get bigger and all over the. We can zip line anywhere in the world, couldn't we? <gasps> I think so. Nice. Uh, I don't like those. Well, it makes my nerves you crazy. You so good. Well, it's only like standing there thinking about right. it, Stand and right. I get crazy nervous. All right, here we go. Thank, thank you. you. Okay, perfect. Oh, buddy. Yeah, Kelly, you weren't wrong. <laughs> no, I don't. Oh, <laughs> that is great. He's got his gloves. Yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that was uh, that was a lot of fun. So much fun. All right. Oh, I can. Look, he's got his gloves on. Yeah, he's got his gloves. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. All right, everyone, we are back where we started, back at the hotel. That was an 11 hour excursion. That was a long one, but chock full, as you saw, of adventure. Anyone yeah. want to throw out a highlight? Anything that anyone enjoyed? Yes. Go ahead, see what we got. What I've enjoyed it was um, the zip line. Ooh, oh, that yeah. was so yeah. much fun. Yeah. <laughs> what cool. I really enjoyed was the woodworm nice hiking to the zip line and then doing the zip line yeah of course so the the zip line is a big highlight for the kids huh yep what about you cal yeah i think for me it was definitely the underwater river oh, or absolutely. under yeah okay. underwater under, underground river underground river yes um for sure with just the, the rocks and it was cool in there and um educational educational and had the stag stalagmites stalactites it was i liked it yeah, that was a lot of fun. For me, uh, definitely, uh, as Grant has said, the woodworm was pretty cool. Uh, really, the mangrove trip was enjoyable. The whole thing, uh, honestly, was awesome. I wouldn't, yeah. uh, you can actually do just part of that, or uh, again, as we did all of it, it was great. So, Forrest, yeah. did you have a highlight today, buddy? What did you like to, that you did today? Uh, we have a hat and a light jacket. Oh, yes. And I see a bus. Living upside down. You saw, so you like the hat, the jacket, you like the cave. You the saw the cave. bats upside down. Yeah. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah, us too. So what a day and a big thank you to Get Your Guide. It was so well organized. Oh. 
It was really smooth enjoyed. Yeah, I, I, and fun and kid friendly. The whole the whole experience was yeah, organized. It was yeah, nice. absolutely. I'd highly recommend them as a company. Uh, yeah, get your guide. It was awesome. All right, everybody. See you in the next episode.